All right, here you have an Aosmith water heater, Aosmith port adapter, and a Skycentric CTA 2045 module. You can see that when it's got a solid pink light, it's factory fresh. And now we're going to show you how to put it onto your Wi-Fi network. So you've downloaded the Skycentrics mobile app. There's a blue white plus sign at the bottom. You click on that and it has set up a device. So I'm going to click on set up a device. Okay. Now you will notice that over here on this module, you can see it ends in D76. If you have a number of Skycentrics devices, it ends in D76. So it's already set up and I hit next and it says you have to go and connect to that device's Wi-Fi network. So now I'm going to go to the Wi-Fi settings and I'm gonna find that same D76 at the end with the pound in front. That means I'm gonna connect. Okay, you'll notice you don't need a password for that. It's going to check the quality of your internet connection. That's what phones do these days. It's going to drop down and say there is no connection, but that's fine. You're connecting to this module. You're not connecting to the internet. And now the current network is that D76 network. And I'm ready to go back to my app, the Skycentrics app, and I'm ready to click next. So now it says that I can scan the sticker with the QR code. So I'm clicking on scan and I'm going over and you'll see that it got the QR code and then now it's thinking it's loading up the information from the QR code, great. Now it's saying choose your network. So I'm choosing our network, Skycentrics Unify and I'm entering our password. Okay, and I'm clicking next. And now it says uh, please connect to the Wi-Fi with the internet. Oh, I need to go back and just connect to the internet, which it does generally automatically. So you'll see that's our Unify. It does it automatically, but we encourage you to check that and make sure you're back on the internet and then you click next. So now you notice that it's communicating to the cloud. It's saying, what kind of name do you want to give this? So A.O. Smith. Uh, water heater, it's a, what type of device is it, an Aosmith water heater, and then um, you can just say, see it's got the serial number, so I'm going to hit add device. It says success, your device is ready to use, and you'll notice if you back up a little bit that now there's a solid blue light. So what happened while we were focusing on the mobile app is that as soon as we tried to say connect to our Skycentrics Unify network, that this module went into a blinking pink pattern until it got blue, and now it does blue and alternating with a few flashes, and it shows that you were successfully connected all the way to the cloud and your device is set up and ready to use. So that's it. If you want a tour of how to use the mobile app, we give you a little tour, tell you how to do things, and once you're done with that, you're basically all set. And if you go to that Aosmith device, you can see that there it is, it's on, it's using 4,500 watts, and it shows a storage capacity of 300. Uh, you can see the graphing of your water heater usage. You can schedule your water heater, and uh, if there's details, you can see the serial number, etc. And that's the Skycentrics app and the provisioning process to the Wi-Fi network.